Hey everyone, welcome back to the Awesomer Pop channel. Hope everyone's been enjoying all of the Halloween content we've been putting out recently. Today, we're going to show you how to make a Play-Doh Halloween cake. It's a fun project you can do with your friends and family, and it would make a very unique Halloween decoration as well. Alright, let's start by making our cake. If you're not going to cut the Play-Doh cake for fun, it doesn't really matter which colors you use. But if you do want to follow, we'll be using this dark orange and light orange Play-Doh. Use a circular cutter. Perfect! And you want to make your cake layer a little bit thick. You don't want it too thin. Here's a closer look at our orange cake layer. Now let me quickly make another one. Use the same cutter. Now let's do the same with this light orange Play-Doh. Use this cutter again. Okay. Here's a closer look. Let's make one more. Awesome! Now let's stack each layer. Start with the light orange on the bottom, then the dark orange, light orange again, and dark orange. Awesome! It's like a candy corn cake, but here's a closer look. Okay, now we're gonna cover this entire cake with black Play Doh. Roll this out. Use the same cutter. Now let's stack this on top. Now we need to cover the sides, so we're gonna roll out some more black Play Doh. And make sure your strip of Play Doh can cover the entire side. Cut a little slice off here. Okay, now let's wrap this around. And it's okay if you have extra Play-Doh sticking out like this. Just use a sharp tool to make marks all around. Then unwrap the Play-Doh. And cut off all that extra Play-Doh. Okay, now let's wrap this around again. Clean the sides up. Perfect. Now I'm going to use this pasta noodle extruder to make a bunch of white spaghetti noodles. Cut it right here. Now let's start decorating our cake. These white noodles will be ribbon frosting decorations. Remove any extra Play-Doh. Perfect! Here's a closer look. Okay, now let's grab small pieces of white Play-Doh and roll them out into thin logs. Like this. And I don't know if you remember our Play-Doh sheep cake, but we're going to do something similar. We're going to curl this Play-Doh up and make the letter S. Best way I can explain it. So you want something like this. And let's attach this on top of the cake. And we're just going to make a bunch of these and attach them all around the edge. There we go. Now let's add little white chocolate drops on the side of the cake. Give me a minute. There we go. Alright, now let's make a skull design. We're gonna go more Day of the Dead vibes. I know that's after Halloween, but I like the design, so we're gonna go with that. Give me a minute while I make the skull. Add some black Play-Doh in the eyes. Let's also add black Play-Doh in the nose. Make the smile. 
Awesome! Let's attach the skull right on the center. Now let's use orange Play-Doh to make a few pumpkins. Use this tool to make the ribs. Poke a hole right here. And make a tiny green cone for the stem. There we go. Isn't this a cute pumpkin? Make a few more like this and place them around the skull. Alright. This is definitely one of the cooler cakes we made. Here's a closer look. Now let's cut out a slice. And if you're following along, this is why I recommended using different shades of orange. Look how beautiful this cake slice looks. Here's a closer look. And you can also show off the whole cake like this too. It looks pretty good, don't you think? Definitely give this a try at home. Awesome Pop fans! Thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!